What's up guys? Hello, welcome back to my channel. For today's <coughs> video, we are going thrifting. Thrifting! So I have my assistant with me here today. He's holding my basket because, you know, he's my assistant. You got a close-up of my hand. Ooh. Like look through to the raw footage and you're like, what is Ralph trying to do? Hello, welcome back to my channel for today's video. Oh, actually, before I do that, hi guys, welcome back. If you're new here, hi, my name is Farina, and nice to meet you. For today's video, as you can tell from the title, this is a thrift haul, and I'm also gonna call this um, with what you can get with $100 at the thrift store, because honestly, guys, I got so much good stuff and like really good brands, and I'm so excited because it has been a hot minute since I went thrifting, and I'm so excited that like, the recent thrift trip that I went to was a successful one. So yeah, anyways, I know you guys are excited to see the items because I'm super excited to show you guys. Um, as always, if you guys are not subscribed yet, please go ahead and click subscribe down below. Also, if you guys like me and you want to see more of me and like be updated with my daily life, just go and follow me on my Instagram, which is afarina.aguinaldo. And yeah, anyways, let's go and get started. So let's start off with bottoms because the first one I have is this pair of Lulu Lemon leggings, you guys. If you guys are a Lulu Lemon like lover, user, wearer, you guys know how expensive Lulu Lemon is. And I mean, I love Lulu Lemon. I would still like pay the ninety dollars for my leggings, but. You know how expensive they are and I found a pair at Goodwill like there's a little logo you guys I mean I was just like oh my god like this is a sign that it's gonna be a good thrift trip I was like oh my god Lululemon legging Lululemon legging Lululemon legging say that three times guys I was literally like manifesting that I would find a Lululemon legging and found this Lululemon legging like it was just like in between like hangers so anyways I believe this was like eight dollars but I'm not complaining because like if you know Lululemon leggings are like ninety dollars and up so I would rather take the eight dollars than the ninety dollars moving on to another active wear I picked up this Under Armour leggings because you guys know that I've been on this like workout grind lately and it's just like this black and white stripe Legging and this one is a capri size. The Lululemon leggings one goes all the way down to my ankles. Take a shot every time I say Lululemon legging. I think you would be blacked out by now. Up next, we have this jean skirt from Reformation. I believe Reformation is a sustainable brand, but I for sure know that Reformation is not a cheap brand. So I picked this jean skirt. This is what it looks like. Um, it has these really cool pockets on the back. It looks like they kind of just like, you know, move the pockets because there's the lining on here but the pockets is actually like right here. I also really like the stressing on the waistline as well as the bottom. I just thought this was a really awesome like deal on the seat, but it was definitely under $10, which was awesome because like I said, like Reformation is not a cheap brand. And also I don't wear skirts that often, but back to school is coming up and I feel like I can like make an outfit for this. And it's also the summertime, so I wanted to like, you know, try something new, but this is just what it looks like. Then I also picked up a couple couple of shorts and the first one I have is this one from Brandy Melville you guys I was like ooh exciting so it's this olive green um, low waist uh, jean shorts it's in really good condition and um, it's just like this green one I don't own a color like this so I was super excited to like cop these at the thrift store and then we have these pair of jean shorts and this is from the brand BDG and BDG is 
an Urban Outfitters um, like jean brand or like they have they carry them at Urban Outfitters and also they're not like the cheapest one. So I picked up these black short shorts. These are super super comfortable and they have grown to be my favorite pairs because they're super super soft. They're not tight around my waist and they're actually pretty stretchy if you ask me. So this is just what it looks like. There's a little distressing on the pocket area here. There's also like a rouging on the bottom of course. I picked up another BDG item. Again they carry this brand at Urban Outfitters but I got it at the thrift store. And it is this like black light wash jeans and I actually don't own a lot of like non-distressed jeans especially in this color so I was like oh my god like hopefully this fits me and when I tried it on you guys oh my god it is so freaking soft I actually wore these on a bit last night and it's super comfortable but yeah so I really enjoy this so whoever gave this to Goodwill like thank you so much because this is super super soft and I can see myself wearing this a whole lot I have this white corduroy like flared pants I know flared pants is not everyone's taste but I just think they're so freaking cute you guys it has two buttons on the little waistline there's a zipper and this is from the brand um, Union Bay I don't know if that's like an expensive brand or anything it's my first time hearing it but the quality of this one is amazing you guys it's just this white corduroy pants it has this little buckle on the side and then it just like flares all the way down moving on to tees I love getting tees from the men's section like I think as soon as I like step into the thrift store the first like section I go to is the men's section because I love wearing oversized tees and they always have like really really good quality tees so the first one I have is this white one and it says Lake Tahoe and it is so freaking beautiful like, I just like really like it I'm not gonna crop I don't think I'm gonna crop this one but if you wanted to you can crop it but I love wearing these kind of tees especially when I go to sleep and then I saw this Paradise Cove um, t-shirt and if you guys are not familiar with Paradise Cove. It is a restaurant in Malibu and this color right here is probably my favorite type of red. It's kind of like a vintage like washed um, red and on the back it just says Paradise Cove Guest Relations. So I'm definitely not cropping this because the Guest Relations is too big and yeah. And the last t-shirt I got is this one right here. It is this like light wash like grayish blue color. I also really really love this color. You guys know that I love Hawaii with all my heart. Like I wish... I wish I am manifesting it that I'm going to Hawaii this December for Christmas. Please. But it's just like this Maui uh, tee and it has a little like turtles in just Maui, Hawaii and then on the back that's what it looks like. So um, yeah, I had to pick this one up. It says Tropical Living um, Maui, Hawaii, Ka'anapali, White Leia. I'm a Hawaiian. I've been mistaken as Hawaiian before, especially when I go to Hawaii, but I'm a Hawaiian. So I hope I pronounced that right, but it's just, ugh, I love this color, you guys. I. I am in love with that color. I picked up this like thermal like material and this one reminds me of a Harley Davidson for some reason but it's not Harley Davidson. I'm thinking of cropping this to be completely honest because I feel like it'll just like look a lot cuter but it's just like this um, logo right here. It looks like it's like wheels with wings so that's why like I was like oh is this Harley Davidson but it's like really not. Moving on I picked up a flannel and my favorite flannels are from the thrift store because I'm like very specific with my flannels I like a thick flannel but like not thick to the point where it's like I can only wear it in the winter time but it's like a really good quality like thick men flannel like those are my favorite ones so I picked up this like oat yellow color and I love this material I don't know how to explain the material you guys but like Sometimes when you just like touch a flannel you're like this is it this is it and also if you guys shop with Brandy Melville a lot you know for a fact they get their flannels from the thrift store that's the tea guys that's the tea they get a lot of things from the thrift store like those collared ones like the Ralph Lauren collared ones the crop ones those are from the thrift store and they just like crop it and sell it for like $40 I'm just like why moving on to the next couple items I have this super bright blue Ralph Lauren um, sweater and these are my favorite sweaters the one that like zips up like the three-fourth zip ups um, I'm not really into like zip up this is from the brand Ralph Lauren but I picked it up at the thrift store of course and I think 
I'm gonna crop this. So I feel like it has the potential to be cute if it's cropped, but like not too cropped, you know? And then another bluish item that I have is this like long sleeve from Calvin Klein and it just has the logo here. Now this is something that I for sure will crop because it just looks really weird not cropped. So it's just a little v-neck but I think it's nice to have in my closet especially because I don't own like a color or like I don't have this color in my closet. Moving on to the next couple of items. These are more like active wear like the top part. So I have this beige or oat color um, top and if you guys know the brand Set Active like it has the same like material it's like that nylon spandex material like they were so popular i used to have like tank tops like this like in every single color because they were so popular in middle school but then um when i went to high school i like gave them away because i'm like well these are not like in style anymore they're not trendy anymore so i'm not gonna wear them but now they're coming back so it's like literally fashion recycles over time and then i found this fabletic sports bra and i've never tried Fabletics before but I heard a lot of people say that it's like a really good like activewear brand so I was really excited to just, like see this at the thrift store because I really wanted to try it but it is just like this black sports bra it has padding I know it looks huge but it's actually really nice and it fits me really well and then on the back it has this little cut and then you see that little Fabletics like logo here I literally had to search because I was like wait this logo looks so familiar but I like didn't know what it was so then I was like oh wait I think it's Fabletics so like my boyfriend and I like searched it and it is indeed Fabletics. I picked up this Adidas tank top one um like I said I've been on this workout grind. It's really nice to find like workout clothes at the thrift store so it comes with this like bra on the inside. It is not padded but it fits me really well and I'll still like wear it. The last two items I have are like leather jackets. I don't think they're real leather honestly. I actually really 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 love wearing leather jackets. I think it's like my go-to look especially if I'm going for a night out with friends um, with some like mom jeans or like boyfriend jeans with like a bodysuit. It's just like nice to like complete the outfit. Um, so I picked this one up. This one looks worn out but I honestly really like how vintage and like worn out it looks. Anyways, this is from the brand Zara and it has this like moto feel on the shoulder type of thing and then on the hand part. And then last but not least, I picked up another leather jacket and this one is also from Zara. Now, do you guys see the difference from this one to here? But this one is a lot more worn out and like super like relaxed and flimsy but this one is a lot more structured um it has the same moto design here it is also from zara if i haven't mentioned it this was only ten dollars zara can sometimes be a little expensive so i was super stoked to like find those items that concludes my thrift haul you guys i hope you guys enjoyed it because i definitely enjoyed going to the thrift store um, yes yeah, so if you guys would like to see more thrift store or thrift trips go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below what was your favorite item that i got also before i forget i am hosting a giveaway right now i'm giving them a school supplies because it is back to school season cries um but yeah so if you guys want to join that giveaway i'll put the link down below and I also put it like a little card up here that you guys can click so you guys can go ahead and watch so yeah anyways i love you guys so 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 much and i will see you guys next time bye